Hi, my name is Chris Parry. I'm director of On Demand at Sky TV, and I've been asked to demo Sky Player and its new implementation on the Windows Media Center on Win 7 devices. I can actually drive this in any one of three ways. I can use touch, which I'll do here. Um, I can also use a keyboard and a mouse, and I can also use a remote control. So uh, to give you an example, if I go to documentaries here, I have a few highlights of on-demand programming um, across the whole genre, but if I go into channels here, it will show you the five uh, documentary channels that we have um, available at the moment. And if I double tap into those, I'll go, I'll drill in. So if I go to live TV, we have 24 live channels at the moment. That number will grow uh, and continue to grow going forward. Um, just to give you an idea of the type of brands you can see, uh, very strong in sports, uh, news, um, documentaries, and kids. Uh, I can drill into any one of these, but then play out the channel. Now, for those of you that have Sky TV, this should be a familiar environment because this looks like the search and search and scan bar that you get when you click the light blue buttons on your remote control. And within there, I can change the quality level if I wish. There are three quality levels, user selected um, high at 1.8 megabits a second, medium at 1.1, and low at 600. So if I click on that, it'll go to medium. While it's doing that, uh, um, I'll show you some other features. So I can get information if I like, just the same way the EPG works. I can look forward in, t in time in terms of what else is on this channel. I can go up and down to see what's available on other channels as well. So if I, let's say I go to Sky Sports 1, and then click and watch now. So again, I'm going to um, buffer and play out again. Now if I go back to the home page, you'll see that what I'm watching continues to play out in the bottom left. So it's a nice mini TV type of feature that we have in our more recent EPGs. I go home. So just to close, I'll show you an on-demand experience as well. So let's say I'm interested in watching a movie, which is, which is a good example. So if I click into movies, so I then have, you know, at the top I have some sort of highlights or latest. Let's say that I want to uh, explore by category. So I'll go in and then I have um, all the key genres that you use to explore titles. There are 500 movies available here for free if you're a Sky Movie subscriber. So let's say I want to watch an action thriller. Um, and you can see that we have a great deal of choice in that genre. Then you can choose one of those and play it out. So that is Sky Player.